Light flicker may be one of the most common problems for brick filmers. It can be really distracting in your videos and even experienced brick filmers have problems with this. So in this video, I'm going to show you how I took one of my videos and in post fix a light flicker to make it a more pretty video. Videos, videos, videos! Okay, the first thing you need is the culprit. The video that was filled with light flicker, whether it was because you did something or because your camera did something. For me, my Thanksgiving film had a lot of trouble with this, so I'm going to be using the first shot of that as an example. Okay, the next thing you need is you'll need either Virtual Dub or Virtual Dub Mod. This is the program we will be using to remove the light flicker. You will also need the MSUD flicker filter. Both of these things can be downloaded online and I'll have links in the description. So, we open up the program and now we select the file we want to fix the light flicker. Now using the controls on the bottom we can play through the footage and yeah. So now we will go to video filters, add, load, and now we'll select the filter we downloaded. Now we'll scroll down to the filter, select it, hit OK, MSU normal, and you can leave on its default settings. OK. Now we hit OK again, but if you play through the video now, you'll see that the light flicker is still there. That's because this filter removes light flicker after you export it. So to do that, we will go to File, Save At. Now we will name our thing, I'll call it MSU and you want to leave it uncompressed now hit save and now it will export your video and then we're done so now we'll close it so now the video has been exported to the folder where the original video file was as you can see that light flicker has been removed and the film just looks a whole lot better yay okay then so now if your videos have light flicker you can just blame laziness which is probably a bigger problem for brick filmers than light flicker if you think about it. And it's also the reason I haven't released a video in more than a month. I better get back to work.